Hi gardeners, it's been a rough week. It really has. I know the lighting's terrible right now, but this is the only time of day I can stand and be out here. I, it is the hottest part of summer, July and August, and I do not enjoy my garden in July and August. I, I enjoy the, the harvest, but I don't enjoy being out here. So I'm only out here for a few minutes at a time. I'm older and I have breathing problems, so I can only work out here for maybe 10 minutes at a time. I've got a little footage for you of my week, but I'm probably only gonna post on Sundays till the weather cools. I'm going to definitely post. It, I mean, I'm, it's early in the morning and I am already feeling the heat. The other morning I was out here at 7 in the morning. I was dripping with sweat. Thank God it rained a little last night, so I might not have to water today. I'm going to post in the fall and the winter. I do things in the fall and winter. I do a lot of things. There are gardening things, if you live in the south especially that you can be doing in the, the fall and winter. It's my favorite time to garden, it really truly is. But right now, it's just not. So I'll go back to two a week in probably September. But right now, it's probably just gonna be once a week. I'm just not getting very much footage because I'm just not out here. But what have I done this week? Well, I did harvest some potatoes. It wasn't a great harvest. I got twice as many last year. I harvested corn. The potatoes, I did video some of that. The corn, um, I harvested corn. I didn't video that. My son and I went out there real quick, snatched it all up and came in. It was a it was a really crappy harvest. I literally got, again, twice as much last year. I just didn't have the germination rate. My son seems to think it's because we used cheap kernels. I thought we used the same kernels we used last year, but he's young. He has a better memory than me. I harvested pinto beans. I've got a video of that for you. In fact, that's probably the one I've got the most video of because I showed me shelling them and weighing them. So I'll include that in this video. This will be a longer video because I'm only gonna do once a week. So try to watch a little more of it. Um, oh, and real quick, if you haven't done it, please subscribe. I am so trying to grow this channel. I'm struggling to get to 200, um, but it's what it is. Um, I come out here every couple days early in the morning and just snatch up. I'm getting tomatoes like crazy. I might try to do a video on that next Sunday because I really am truly getting tomatoes every day. I'm getting okra every day with just four okra plants. And I've only got six tomato plants, but I'm collecting a ton of okra and a ton of tomatoes. I pulled out some more zucchini plants this week and I replaced them with beans, so uh, pinto beans, because I got such a good pinto bean harvest and really didn't require much work for me. And that's it. That's what I've, I've done this week. I'm going to put this into um, one long video and I hope you enjoy it. I, I it's just too hot. It's just too hot for me to be out here. I love gardening, but in July and August, I, I just can't. I just can't, if you can either. Don't beat yourself up. <laughs> it's hot, you know, it, it, it is, it really is. But that's it for now, and I'll see you guys in the next one, bye. So, it's really too hot to be out here, but I need to dig up potatoes, so you can see how my potatoes get. 
I don't think they did it that well. They just, they never really grew before the green started dying back. So this is what they look like. I'm gonna leave these over there a couple more weeks because those are still doing okay. But these need to come up. You have to be careful with your shovel. Otherwise, this will happen. So I'll have to cook that one tonight. <laughs> but I've got quite a few pretty good sized red potatoes. Well, some of these are bigger than my early, the potatoes that I pulled early, but some of them are quite little. Hi, so I have been shelling beans for hours, but we're gonna see the final result. So, can you see the scale? Excuse all the other produce I've been harvesting. I planted 30 beans, so I decided to weigh them and see how much 30 beans weigh. So, about four tenths of an ounce. What did I get out of it? Two pounds and 7.8 ounces. I'd say that is a win. Oh my God, it, that's a total win. Excuse my mess back here. I've been moving things around. I haven't cleaned up yet and I'm usually very conscious of that, but I just, I just wanted to do this. So, yes, I lost my zucchinis, but after a pretty good harvest of them. And I'm gonna revisit that issue in a couple of days. But I've been getting okra, green beans, and tomatoes. So, my harvest is pretty good this year. And the beans are great. And I think I will plant a second round of pinto beans and red beans. It's July, so they like heat. And I'll have time to harvest them before the first frost, but yay for my bean harvest. I'm just so excited. Um, it's been a bad week. Well, last week was a bad week and losing the zucchini and my pumpkins are sick, and um, but this made up for it. That's it for now. I'll catch you next one. Bye.